Welcome to Daily Dose Radio, a five-minute devotional podcast studying the Psalms verse by verse, broadcast from the ever-beautiful Sharonville, Ohio, on the sunny side of Cincinnati. Hey, welcome back. This is Fair Trade Bible Study. It's Fair Trade because Daily Dose Radio is promoting the sustainable development of better Bible study on a global scale. That's Daily Dose Radio for you. Come on in. This is the Bible Bistro. Come on in. Sit down. Let's have a moment together and we can study God's Word. Looking today at the last two verses of this section of Psalm 22. Now, remember now, I've artificially divided Psalm 22, so it's not... This These sections are my own division. They're not suggested by the text in any way. Although, I think today I could have an argument to be, there's an argument to be made for the way I've divided this section out, 10 or 11 through 20. Now I'll get to that in just here in a moment. Uh, just let me remind you real quick about our website, my-dailydose.com. Come on, check it out. It's just on the internet right down the way, and you can find out you know what's there. See the links, the additional stuff on the blog. You can check out the uh, postings. There's information about me and this program there. Also, you can find the daily, the weekly translations. And although I'm going to have to change this week's translation because I've discovered I made an error, so you'll find that there as well under the word. Just check it out. There's PDFs there where they have the translations, easy to get a hold of. So check out my-dailydose.com. Today we're reading verses 19 and 20. But you, O Lord, do not be far away. O my helper, to my help come quickly. Take away the sword from my soul, my life from the hand of the dog. We've seen the dog before, haven't we? We had dogs in verse 16. We'll talk about that in here in just a second. So, here is 19 and 20. Notice that we don't have any imagery from the cross, but what we have here is the conclusion of this prayer, or at least this part of the prayer. And as I said, I think there's a nice division that occurs here because we have a repeated word in verse 19. But you, O Lord, do not be far away. We've, we've seen that prior. We saw that word that very word used in verse ooh, verse 1. Yeah, in verse 1. Far from my deliverance are the words of my complaint. So he says, now, you, you know, so far away, my deliverance, it's so far from my words that it's, it, you can't even measure the distance. And that's the idea of this word that's translated far from or far away from. It's this great divide. Verse 11 began with, do not be far from me. Now we come to verse 19, which ends this section for us, for for Daily Dose Radio. And I think we have a nice argument to be made that 11 through 20, or 11 through 19 at least, is a section of its own, because here we have the word again. But you, O Lord, do not be far away. The distance is great, and the Lord God has separated himself from his Son. Don't be far away. And then notice this beautiful poetry here. Oh, my helper. I loved translating this. Oh, my helper. To my help, come quickly. Now, is that a prayer or is that a prayer? Oh, friends, if we could pray this way, would you pray this prayer with me? Oh, my helper. To my help, come quickly. Because there's only one place to go for help. There's only one person to call out to when it comes to help, and that is to the Lord. And listen to to Messiah. Call him my helper, capital H now, my helper. Oh, my helper, to my help, come quickly, speedily. Come from far away, but come quickly. Take the sword from my soul. Now, this is beautiful because this is not— we've been talking about the physical condition of Christ on the cross— But it's just not his body that's being broken. It's his soul. The sword has pierced to the dividing asunder, not only of flesh and marrow, but of soul and spirit. Jesus has been wounded spiritually because his death propitiates eternally for all those who have sinned against God. Friends, that includes you 
and me. So let's cry out to our helper today to come and help quickly. I hope you'll join me again next time on Daily Dose Radio. Thanks for listening to Daily Dose Radio. I'm David Smith. The music today has been performed by the Bluegrass Experiment. Thanks again for listening. I'll see you next time on Daily Dose Radio.